guys. It's been two months. It's been like two months video. And so. we just never felt like it. He's a, he uploaded one today. I uploaded one today, and I'm gonna upload another one. Yep. Here we go. Um, it's and that one that uh, was uploaded earlier, if you guys saw, it's actually from a couple months ago too. So don't think that it was just filmed. It was filmed a while ago, but I forgot about it. Two truths, one lie. <clears throat> We're doing two truths and one lie I know lie it's challenge. been a long time. I will. It's been a long time since the challenge. I will explain, guys. So we are gonna read a group of three sentences. Two of them are gonna be true, and one of them, one of. One of them is going to be a lie, and he will have to guess what which one is a lie, and I'll have to guess which one his is a lie. And we have three of them, so okay, I will go first. <clears throat> okay, my first one. I broke a game at Chuck E. Cheese's. I barfed on my teacher's desk, or I met a popular guy from YouTube. Which one is the lie? You barfed on your teacher's desk. How do you know? It's a lie. How did you... You you told me, well, if you've never met a popular guy from YouTube... Yeah, I have. No, that's true. You have to guess which one is the lie. Well, yeah, that one's true, but... No, the, you have to guess which one's the lie. Oh, okay. That, that one's the lie, so you got that the right. The one about barfing on your teacher. That's a lie. Because you told me you broke a game at Chuck E. Cheese. Yeah, I, like, I put in a quarter, guys. And it just broke. No, I put in one of my coins, and then, like, then, like, it just made this, like, big, like, explosion sound. And, like, I tried to play it, and it wasn't working, so I went and told a guy, and he said that it was an old game, and it didn't work very well. And I did meet a popular guy from YouTube. Who was it? Actually, go to my, go to the, there will be in a link in the description, go to Zach Flanagan's channel, guys. Zach Flanagan, yeah. He is my... Cousin. Or something. No. Okay. My mom's aunt... Your family's cousin. My mom's aunt... Dot, my mom has an aunt... And my mom's aunt's granddaughter's boyfriend is who he is. And I have met him a couple days ago. He was at my aunt and uncle's house for Thanksgiving. So I'll, there will be definitely a link in the description to go check him out. He does all kinds of wacky stuff. Okay. Okay. Next. Okay. <laughs> Eat a drumstick on Thanksgiving. Okay. Keep going. Got my stomach cut open okay. at the hospital Okay. whenever I was one week old. Okay. And the last one? Heard Shake It Up coming back from McDonald's. It's a tough one. I'm going to say the second one, the getting your stomach cut. That one's the lie. Yeah, that's what I said. Yep. Okay. I'm I was two weeks old whenever oh. I got... Here, my scar. It's right here. We don't want this. We no. don't have to see that. Okay. It hurts whenever I run. Okay. Now my second one. I had to walk around with a cane because I sprained my ankle. I know how to crash any one of my friends on Xbox. I know how to crash their Xbox. Or I broke my brother's arm. Which one's a lie? I yeah. know it's true. You can hack anyone. I can't hack. I know how to get their Xbox crash because I saw it on YouTube. I'll, I'll tell you guys how to do that on two guesses. Because you know someone who really No, does. no, that's not why. I saw yeah. a video on YouTube. Now keep, no. That's a true. Uh, you broke your brother's arm is, okay. What's the other one? I had to walk around with a cane because I sprained my ankle. I know how to crash any one of my friends' that's Xbox. True. That's true. And I broke my brother's arm. Which one is the lie? Broke your brother's arm is probably true, but... Okay, well, go on, just uh, guess. Okay, we are it's at true, already you did minutes. sprain your ankle. Okay, Didn't so you? which one's the lie, though, guess? You broke your brother's arm. Yes, that's a lie. Yes! <laughs> that is a lie. But I'll, show, I'll tell you guys a little something. Because I know... So, cause... for the Xbox thing, if you on... Only if they have Minecraft. If you invite them to your world on Minecraft... And you go all the way to any end of the world and where you can't place any blocks. Place one block right at the edge of the world. Put a piston behind it. Activate the piston to make it push the block. And that won't do it. Then you gotta do then you gotta do that again. And that will crash everyone in your world's Xbox and yours. So it has a fault to it. But you just, you can just turn your Xbox off and then it'll be fine. Okay, now okay. it's my last one. 
Okay, I got locked out of school. Wait, no, it's my turn. Wait, no, you just did. Oh, yeah, yeah, never mind. Okay. okay. Yeah, go. Just read them. Have won church league basketball three times. Okay. Went to Las Vegas. Drank seven cups of Mountain Dew on Thanksgiving. I'm going to say the church champion three times. You got it! Because I was on his league. We won twice. We won twice. You drank seven cups, and I know you went to Las Vegas. I already knew that mm -hmm. one. I went to the M&M factor. Okay, my awesome. last one. Okay, I got locked out of school. Wait, what? Wait, inside? Locked out. That would be on the outside. Let me keep going. I got locked out of school. I walked into my house and I saw my cat laying in its bed dead. Or I spilled orange juice on my mom. <laughs> I think the first one walked out of school. Okay, that's what you're guessing? No, that's true. Yeah. Twice. That's true. No, you said you have to guess a lie, so you got that wrong. And then I think the orange juice one is a lie. Yeah, but you got you got it wrong because you said the school. I got locked out of school twice. Really? I was in kindergarten, like, I was, like, on the swing set. Then, like, everyone walked in, and I, like, had my eyes closed. Have you guys ever been outside? Like, maybe whoever's in, like, grade school, and they have a swing set. And you're outside, and you like to, like, whenever you're on the swing, and you like to close your eyes because it feels, like, more scary, and you like to close your eyes. So, they, like, the teachers blow their whistle, and I didn't really hear it, and I was closing my eyes on the swing set. Then whenever I open them, and, like, everyone's gone, I'm like, and I start crying, because this was in kindergarten. The first one was in kindergarten. In fourth? Yeah. I start crying. You, you wouldn't have been at the school. I was at St. I start Alice. crying and uh, screaming, so I run out. I run up to the door, and I start just banging on the glass. And then one of the teachers downstairs heard me and came out and opened it. I missed part of lunch that day, because, you know. And the second time it happened very recently, a couple weeks ago. Okay, so we're at recess. Wait, outside. Yeah, outside. We were at recess. Wait, it, at fifth Westgate. Grade. Fifth yeah. grade? Okay. Oh, okay. We were at Westgate. We're, that's where we go to that's school. That's where we go to school. And we went um, We went outside, and I always pack my lunch, if you guys didn't know that. so I pack my lunch. So I walk in, and I notice, oh, I left my lunchbox outside. So I run back out to grab it, and then whenever I look back, the doors are shut, and the doors automatically lock, and the teachers have to unlock it. There's a plus side to that one, though. Sixth grade goes outside right after us, so I just ran. I just ran down, so I didn't start crying because I'm old enough to know that. So I just ran down to one of the teachers, and I said, hey, my class went in, and they just walked up to the door, used their key to open the door and let me in. So okay. that's fine. Okay, your last one. Okay. If we he are gets already it, at seven minutes. If he gets school. this wrong, we tie. If he gets it right, he wins. Okay, okay. let's go. Go. Just do it fast because we don't have much time. The truth. The oh, the, 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 the truth. The truth and the lie. Okay. It's all down to this. Mm -hmm. Two okay. truths and one lie. Okay. Been to Arlington House in Washington D.C. Okay. Met a pro football player. Have three monopolies. The monopoly. That's true. It's in the closet. I have an old one. It's like Pokemon. Oh. And the I know he has Do you know which one's the lie? The football player. No, that's true. I met an old player that played because they have this thing called a fan thing, and I actually have been on Heinz Field, and it's like I know that. And um, they actually had pro players there. Louis Lips, or I don't know his name. Then there was a, I got a, here's my autographed football. I got from two of them. <clears throat> Ow. Sorry. Oh, uh, where is it? Oh, here's one. And then here's the other one. I don't even know who they are. I just know them. They're kind of backwards, but... Oh, yeah, we tied. Yep, we did tie. Here's our papers. Okay, guys, I will just do one little thing now. I'm just going to go through and tell you some truths about my life and some lie. I'll do this first. So, if you didn't get to hear some of them, I'll tell you some. I'll tell you some stories behind them. I already told you the story about the Chuck E. Cheese. I'm going to tell you guys And stories, I told you yeah. the popular guy from YouTube, because we have a little bit of time left on the camera. But, yeah. and, uh, I'll tell you something. Well, well, the 
Well, the whenever I walked in my house, my cat died recently. I think yeah, last year. Yeah, he was coming home from school. <clears throat> I walked right in from school, and she was laying on her bed, and I thought she was sleeping at first. So when if my cats are sleeping when I get home, I give them a little tap on the back to see if they wake up. And I tapped her on the back, and she just kept sleeping there with her eyes closed. And then like I got, I started kind of like spat, like doing it a little bit harder, like a little bit harder, and she didn't wake up. Then I uh, picked her up and like blowed in her face because my cats don't like whenever I blow in their face. And then like some stuff, and then uh, I like I like I, I started crying because she did die, and I told my dad we went out and buried her whenever my mom. Got he out. has a little cemetery in his yard. He's got like a dog. He's got a few cats. He's yeah. got like a uh, a cricket or something. Oh uh, yeah. So we, we buried a moth in my yard. Remember yeah, that? Yeah. We buried a moth. So good some memories. So that was the two truths and well, one lie. Two to two. And see you later. We, we tied. So see you later. Peace. <laughs>